Keeping demons at bay, screaming from on top of a wooden box, trying to keep cool in the face of perceived insanity, and that's just one story. Think you know what I'm on about? Well, stay tuned. I'm taking you on a journey through the mind of Jonan Vasquez and his myriad of the wacky and macabre. Jonan Vasquez was my personal gateway into the world of comics. His works are dark and humorous while also holding a mirror up to our society and the world we live in. Let's start this list with his most well-known work, Invader Zim. Beginning in 2001 as a show on Nickelodeon, Invader Zim would later become an ongoing comic and, most recently, a 2019 film. The comic continues the original show's storyline centering on an alien named Zim from the planet Earth and his mission to conquer Earth along with his malfunctioning robot servant, Gurr. Meanwhile, Zim is constantly antagonized by Dib, a young paranormal investigator who is determined to stop Zim from succeeding. Invader Zim has spawned its own fan convention called InvaderCon, and a plethora of official merchandise, including toys, clothing, collectibles, and accessories, among many other products. Despite the early cancellation of the show due to increasing popularity and above-average merchandise sales, it's now regarded as a cult classic. I absolutely did not spend too much time singing the Doom song or in general acting like Gurr. I have no idea what you're talking about. Filler Bunny. Labeled as the product of insomnia-fueled madness, Vasquez's three-issue series called Filler Bunny is about a lab rabbit called, you guessed it, Filler Bunny, who's forced to fill up pages of a comic book by insane scientists. This genetically engineered happiness rabbit suffers through three entire books for your contentment and distraction. Johnny the Homicidal Maniac. Vasquez's other claim to fame is most certainly his, and also my, first comic series, Johnny the Homicidal Maniac which tells the story of a young man named Johnny Ni C as he explores the psychological and possibly supernatural forces which compel him to commit a string of murders which he always seems to get away with. We're introduced to a plethora of characters along the way, most notably his neighbor, a little boy he refers to as Squee, a brief romantic interest Debbie, and comic strips written by Johnny himself of everyone's favorite ranting lunatic stick figure, Happy Noodle Boy. This series is rife with dark humor, gore, and social commentary, and therefore not for the faint of heart. To be honest, I very probably shouldn't have been reading this in middle school, but here we are! I'm fine, I promise. Vasquez rounds out his library with spin-off works derived from Johnny the Homicidal Maniac, a four-issue series titled Squee, centering around his neighbor, and a full-color double shot, I Feel Sick, about his romantic interest, Debbie. Needless to say, you probably need to have a certain range of interests for Jonan Vasquez to make it onto your shelves. But if you love the Zim cartoon or anything I just described, you should still be able to catch most of his older works and the ongoing Invader Zim comic at your local comic shop. And, of course, be sure to keep an eye on Previews World for more Know Your Heroes. Hey Previews World, did you enjoy this video? Then let's be friends. Follow Previews World by clicking that subscribe button.